Okay, Pisces, welcome back to the channel, guys. If you are new, you are welcome. All right, Pisces, let's get your oracle from the African Goddess Rising Oracles. Holy Spirit, what messages do you have for my Pisces on this Wednesday hump day? Pisces, we have the Seven Sisters. Creativity is in your energy. I'm sorry for the ring like circle. <clears throat> Creativity, guys, that's number 12. If that number means anything to you, it goes down to a three. All right, Seven Sisters, Goddess of Creativity. The temple is conjurers. The Seven Sisters were a mystical Nolens family of the identical master psychics and conjure women who never aged. But were they? Were the Seven Sisters one shape-shifting woman or seven? Time will never tell. <clears throat> Pisces, I'm sorry. Y'all know I'm stuffy and kind of sick, not sick, kind of sick, right? So Seven Sisters guidance here, Pisces, is create, 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 exclamation point. You come from conjurers, creators. Your blood remembers. Use your gifts to multiply your magic. You are a cosmic creatrix and creative force. Your embodiment here, Pisces, is you are a divine nation within one person. How creative do you allow yourself to be? Break out of your comfort zone and into your creative fertility. You have the power that creates planets. So yes, you are creative. No one else's opinion matters here. Let your inner child play to awaken your creativity. Creating is birthing. Creating is birthing is manifesting. So your goddess declaration here, Pisces, is I am a creative visionary. Pisces, you're creative, right? And you know you're creative. <clears throat> Pisces are creative. But you're sleeping on it. You're sleeping on your creativity. Come from behind the shadows, Pisces. Put your stank on it, right? Get your creativity out there, whatever it is that you're working on. Do not hinder yourself. Holy Spirit for Pisces, what is going on? Pisces, something may be coming to an end because it's just too many burdens and you're walking away. You're standing in your strength. Something's coming to an end. Four of Wands with these Ten of Wands upright, it's burdens. Four of Wands is in reverse. Three of Wands, you're taking the first step forward to walk away, and you're standing in your strength, and you're walking a lion. You don't walk dogs, Pisces. You walk lions, okay? You're standing in your strength here. It looks like you're ending something. Five of Pentacles. <clears throat> you could be feeling left out in the cold. You could be having some money problems a little bit or whatever. Some financial difficulties for feeling left out in the cold. You feel you feel left out in the cold, Pisces. And nothing came of this situation. It was burdens. You kept trying to create something with this person. But with the seven of pentacles in reverse, you just didn't reap any rewards from this connection. Pisces, you could be celebrating with other people now. Now that you walked away. With this three of cups. You could be celebrating. And you're standing up to this person because they betrayed you probably seven times with the seven of swords. Very sneaky, very conniving type energy. Right, Pisces? And you, you may have stood up to this person. This is the ten of pentacles in reverse. Four of wands in reverse. This could have been your family. You had a family with this person. Or you lived just the two of you together. It has stability, but you're walking away. Two of Wands in reverse. You're definitely not giving to this connection anymore. You're not going towards this person anymore. You're not giving them your energy anymore. Pisces, this world is over. You could be celebrating the fact that it's over. Yeah, you could be celebrating the fact that it's over. This is a Ten of Swords. With the Seven of Swords here to the Ten of Swords, this person betrayed you. Not only did they do it seven times, Pisces, they came back for more. They did it ten times, right? Holy Spirit, four of wands in reverse for my Pisces.
Nine of Cups upright. Pisces, this was your emotional fulfillment. You were happy with this person. But it became burdened some type of a way. Spirit, clarify the Ten of Wands. There's no new beginnings. You feel like you're doing it all by yourself. You're burdened, Pisces. You're tired. You're walking away. Two of Cups in reverse with the Three of Wands. You're walking away. Two of Cups is in reverse. And you're standing in your strength. You're standing in your strength. You're starting completely over. Page of Pentacles, you said, I'll start at ground zero if I have to, right? You're starting over. You have a Queen of Wands here. You felt left out in the cold. Your person was cheating with another person. Yep, you feel like they left you out in the cold. And the fact that they was cheating with another person, you took your love back from this person, Pisces. They was given to other people. Nothing came of this. Pisces, you're letting it go. You're going to take a leap of faith. You want new beginnings. You're just going to step out on faith, Pisces, and move on. Holy Spirit, clarify the Three of Cups for Pisces. Yeah, you're frustrated, Pisces. You're frustrated because your person was out there. They was out there. Seven of Swords, Spirit. The magician. Pisces, I don't know if this person was doing magic on you. With these nine of pentacles here. Either that or you manifested your way up out of there, right? You could have... You know, got yourself, you manifested your way up out of there. You're single. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, Knight of Swords in reverse. You feel like you jumped into this connection without thinking. King of Cups in reverse. This person didn't offer you the love that you deserve. King of Cups in reverse. You're moving on, Pisces. This world's over. Yeah. You a hermit. You're just thinking about it. You're thinking about the ending. Spirit, Ten of Swords. They did you in, Pisces. They did. They did you in. Ace of Cups in reverse. Knight of Pentacles in reverse. This person was unreliable, Pisces. They did not treat you well at all. Pisces, you're standing in your strength. You're moving on. Because your person was stepping out on you, Pisces. Holy Spirit for Pisces. Takes time, Pisces. <coughs> you have the clock here. You need time. It takes time. And in time. Time to heal. So you can progress. Go forward. You will heal from this, Pisces, and you will bounce back. Yep, healing your heart, healing from heartbreak. This is freedom from a toxic uh, relationship and or an addiction. Pisces, this was the golden mirror. You was with a self-absorbed self narcissist. This was a one-sided relationship. They love-bombed you, Pisces. But that's okay. You're going to be okay. You're going to move on, and you're going to tap back into your creativity. You're going to take the energy from this effed upness right and you're gonna channel it first it's gonna start out fiery because you're pissed and then you're gonna do this and then you're gonna do this and then you're gonna do this and then next you know you're gonna finish that book you're gonna finish that painting you're gonna finish this you're gonna create this you're gonna start your own company you're gonna do this this here is gonna put fire up under your butt to step back into your creativity you probably manifested your way up out of there. You said, you know what, let me get up out of here with the magician card. And then now you're single right here. That's you, single and abundant. You manifested your way up out of this crap. You did. You did. They played you and you got yourself up out of there. Period. Amen. Thanks for watching, Pisces. Please like, share, and subscribe.
increase.